I was here at my shop this morning waiting on the delivery and I uh, thought I'd do a quick little video about a uh, problem I had with a tool. I was changing a coil in a uh, package unit the other night and when I got ready to weigh the charge in my testos died. I'll stick up a uh, picture here so you can see what the uh, <laughs> what was going on. Basically the liquid was coming out of every hole she had. So when I got back to the shop they're old and out of warranty. I uh, pulled them apart and, and pressure tested and the high pressure transducer over here was leaking. As you can see they've got a uh, real hard resin of some sort to keep it locked in. So I took a uh, flat blade screwdriver, an old screwdriver, heated it up with a torch and melted the resin off. Uh, of course then you could unscrew the uh, transducer pretty easily because it's just got an O-ring beneath it. Here's what the transducer looks like. You can see where the O-ring makes contact there around the perimeter. The O-ring looked bad. I took it out with a pick and uh, actually had like some flat edges on it. It had kind of gotten a little hard. So uh, I put a little nylog on it and screwed this transducer back in and it would hold pressure. But the transducer itself doesn't work. I don't know if I did something to it, taking it apart, or if uh, all that liquid pouring across the wires did something to it. But it will not uh, register any longer. So, uh, my buddy Justin Henning up in New Jersey it has lost a uh, has a broken temperature clamp for his. So I'm gonna pack up all these spare parts. The hook in the door or something that sometimes breaks. I'm going to pack up all these spare parts and send up to him. So I had to pick some new gauges. Any guesses what I got? I'm a big fan of uh, HVAC related podcast. It's nice that you can listen while you drive. A lot safer than watching YouTube videos while you drive. Probably a lot safer than making YouTube videos when you drive. But the next morning, uh, as I was going to work, I was listening to uh, Zach's podcast at uh, HVAC Shop Talk, and he had an ad for Yellow Jacket, or he did an ad for Yellow Jacket, um, talking about the new digital gauges. So I saw that as a sign that I needed to get Yellow Jacket. He must be doing a heck of a job with his uh, advertising because most everybody is about two weeks out on getting the new gauges. I'm heading to put in a uh, three-ton condenser and coil this morning, so I'll get to use them for the first time. We can turn the backlight on by yeah. They've got some fairly short leads on the temperature clamps, but they give you an extension lead or two extension leads for them. I like it. 